I was a post-cancer patient and I was left with some very severe neuropathy of both my hands and my feet. I've been treating it for quite some time using some difficult painkillers and opiates. I wanted to do something else to get away from all the heavy medication because it had a lot of side effects. I'd always be either sleepy or, or I couldn't sleep, and I was having a very difficult time walking. I would fall, I would trip. I had to seek some, some alternate solution to my problem because conventional medicine really wasn't solving it. One of the unfortunate aspects of uh, chemotherapy is that while it's toxic to the tumor, it can be also toxic to other tissues in the body. Colonel Pinkson developed a rare complication where he developed neuropathic pain. The chemotherapy healed his tumor but also damaged his nerves. And he had severe pain in both his hands and feet that was poorly controlled by pain relievers. His quality of life was poor. After examining me and hearing the history of my problems, he said, it seems that you're going to be kind of stuck with your neuropathy problem. However, there is this new technology that seems to be providing some very promising results. We were able to put a spinal cord stimulator in. We pass uh, small wires or leads into the spinal canal and deliver electricity to these nerves. So now he has pain relief without all the side effects of his medication. His ability to get out, function, enjoy life is everything he hoped it would be. I have a little remote that you could use to increase or decrease the settings in your stimulator. I just used one of them because I figured once I got one that worked, I'm gonna stick with that. It's working, that's fine. I trusted Dr. Ellis, and here I am today, dancing again. With pain medicine, we don't get to help everybody in the way they would like. But there are times where if we keep plugging away, if we make sure that our patients have access to the newest technology, the newest treatments, we can sometimes find a way to give them their life back. It goes without saying that people who get a second chance at life enjoy it so much more.